The best ever legendary bow in Destiny 2 is right under your nose, literally hiding in plain sight in Season 22, perfect for the upcoming Grandmaster Nightfalls, any endgame level content and most likely the final shape. Point of the Stag is the reprised legendary bow now with a little bit of Telesto madness for good measure. It's the newest one that you can farm till your heart's content from the Iron Banana in Season of the Witch and for the first time ever it comes with random rolls which you can get by dumping your iron engrams into Lord Salad Man. It's a precision frame arc energy bow and it has all your standard perks in the pool like no distractions, dragonfly, golden tricorn and vorpal weapon. Plus you can get the unique combo of Pugilist along with swashbuckler perfect for melee heavy setups. However, this combination right here is what you should be going for especially if you've got endgame aspirations because this makes it arguably the best ever in Destiny 2. It's the first time we've seen this combo thanks to a bunch of newly added perks but it's absolutely majestic on the stag. Archer's tempo and bows go together like peanut butter and jelly and it's a treat on this one. Rapid precision hits will massively increase the knock and draw speed of each arrow, ultimately increasing its damage output potential and lethality. Then with the brand new precision instrument, you're going to get a rolling increase in point of the stag's damage output by simply using it. This perk stacks up to 6 times and it'll grant you a 25% damage boost at the maximum stacks which applies to all types of enemies. This means you only need to land 6 consecutive and rapid hits on enemies to get the weapon damage boost going, perfect for slaying out trash ads or even plinking away at champions or bosses. Now the only real reason to farm for this is its brand new origin trait. Skulking Wolf might as well not exist because Wildcard does and it's basically turning this bow into Telesto. Any final blow has a chance to create experimental sub munitions at the enemy's location which are basically Telesto style projectiles which will explode when nearby to enemies, arguably turning this bow into an exotic that's likely to break the game much like its purple relative does on a regular basis. Now that I've saved you some time, save yourself even more by running this excellent high burst DPS combo and be the envy of your time poor fire team, find out why in this next video.